Concordia nursing graduates, today is an important day for you as you take the time to pin someone important to your life and get ready to graduate and move into the world of nursing. This pinning ceremony is a time to reflect on the past and a time to think about the future. It's a time when you get to recognize those who have walked with you on this journey. Parents, friends, spouses, children, grandparents, colleagues. By you recognizing them, it says they've been important in your life up to this point. But it's also time to think about who you will walk with into the future, especially in these unknown, unprecedented times that we really don't quite know what's gonna happen over the next few months. And so I encourage you to walk into these times, first of all, with your colleagues, as you make friends, as you find mentors, use them, especially those who have gone before you. Listen to them, ask questions, get to know them, take their advice. I hope that you also walk into the future with the company of good books. As you continue your pursuit of critical thinking, compassionate action, and courageous leadership, great texts, great poetry can all help in that, as well as texts about leadership, care, and nursing. I hope you will also walk with Concordia University, Texas. Just as we have been here with you for these past years, we will continue to think about you, to pray for you, to celebrate with you. Let us know what's going on so we can share your stories with others. And finally, I hope that you will walk into the future with God, who says, I will never leave you nor forsake you. He says, don't be afraid, be courageous, because I will be there with you and that can make all the difference in the world. I am so proud of all of you. As you walk into this vocation and serve others in the name of Jesus Christ, I know that you will make a difference. I wanna thank you for entrusting your education to Concordia University, Texas. Remember her, speak well of her, be proud of her, tell others about her, keep her in your prayers and continue to support her with your gifts. And may God go with you as you serve others, care for them, love them, knowing that they are receiving the love and care of Jesus Christ. Congratulations, nursing students. We are so proud of you. We wish you the best in your next steps in your nursing journey. We know you will accomplish great things. Whoosh. Nurses ensure we reach some of the most pivotal moments in our lives. A cancer patient celebrating remission, a newborn headed home from the neonatal intensive care unit, a cardiac patient with a new heart and a new beginning. But nurses also have the skill to care for us during our darkest hours. Nursing isn't just a career, it's a calling, it's a passion, and it is who we are. The heart and the mind of a nurse is unlike any other. Jesus reminds us, this is my commandment. Love one another as I, as I have loved you. Today, more so than ever, we are in need of those with hearts of compassion and love to care for the injured and ill. As we battle with the COVID-19 pandemic, we need men and women who possess the essential combination of a strong educational foundation, unmatched skill, and the emotional fortitude to care for the most vulnerable among us. Concordia University, Texas empowers students of all backgrounds to lead lives of critical thought, compassionate action, and courageous leadership. Concordia develops the mind, heart, body, and soul in preparing leaders for service. As the Dean of the College of Health Sciences, it is my distinct pleasure to introduce you to the newest leaders in our community, the Concordia University, Texas Nursing Class of 2020.
I am Professor Janina Lohon. Please extend both hands, palms up. May your hands be blessed in the name of the Father who created, loves, and sustains you, the Son who redeems you, and the Holy Spirit who empowers you. May these hands bring comfort and healing to those they touch, to the honor and glory of God Almighty. God, our Heavenly Father, you declare your glory and show forth your handiwork in the heavens and in the earth. Deliver us in our nursing practice from the service of self alone, that we may do the work you give us to do in truth and beauty and for the common good. For the sake of him who came among us as one who serves your son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Congratulations.